My last question, bro, before we wrap this up. Is there best that, is there any advice you would give to any up and coming entrepreneur or anybody who came from your environment that's trying to m make it in life? Like I said, like I've been saying, man, if you got an idea, you got something in mind, jump out there with it, man. You ain't gotta, you know what I'm saying? Don't don't make it feel like you gotta spend every dollar, this, this, and that. Like you gotta go all in type. I started with 25 shirts. Okay, I started with 25 shirts. I sold them 25 shirts. I backed up about 50 shirts. Check this out. A nigga stole every shirt that I had out of my car. I spent my last dollars on my, I invested in my clothing line. Mm -hmm. I spent every dollar, bro. I'm talking about I got rent in three days. I spent every dollar, bro. Got 50 shirts, a nigga stole them on my car. I'm talking about the whole box and everything. Didn't steal nothing else. I'm talking about I got shoes in there. I got a laptop in there. I got a touch screen in there. Like, ain't steal nothing. They just wanted to... I don't know what it was. Like, that's why I say, like, this this city be on some real life hate. Like, if it was, like, to go get some money shit, the nigga would have stole the valuable shit that you can go take to the pawn shop real mm -hmm. quick or sell on the streets real quick. You want to steal custom shirts. You feel me? Like, come on, bro. So, that's what I say. Like, you, you got to go out there and get it because... I took that L, lost all my shirts, all my money right there in that whole little while. Boom, I got rent in three days. My rent was 900 at the time. I got to scrounge up $900 in three days to pay my rent and still be able to get some more shirts. So I put every dollar in there. I even took hustle money out of that. Boom. Nah, I ain't finna go get that. I'm finna, I'm finna go get these shirts, you feel me? Because I'm, woo, woo, woo. Nigga took everything from me, bro. I chilled, grinded. Got me a little change. Boom. I started back out with 25 shirts. You know what I'm saying? Jump back head first in. I'm 25 shirts in. You know what I'm saying? So, boom. It just, that's what it is. It's going to, you, you just got to get out there. You feel me? Because I could have stopped right there. I'm like, damn. Nigga took everything from me. I don't even want to do this shit. You know what I'm saying? That'll fuck up your pride. Be like, damn, bro. Like, I really ain't trying to do this shit no more. Like, a nigga just took everything from me, bro. Like, fuck this shit. I ain't trying to do it. Nah. That just made me want to grind harder. Like, damn, okay. I'm really out here like that that you niggas feel like you want to take my shit just because you see a nigga doing something for itself. That, that was made me like, oh, I'm, I'm really out here. I'm really in these niggas' feelings. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's what made me like, oh, yeah. Maybe I do got something going on type shit. Like, if a nigga want to take everything from me just to see me fall, I'm doing something right. That's why I say, like, don't stop, bro. No matter what. Whatever nobody tell you, don't let nobody tell you you can't do something. You can do anything you set your mind to. You right. just got to set your mind to it. You have to be focused. You can't just do anything and think, oh, yeah, I can do this just like this. You have to be focused. You have to set your mind to it and really be focused. And you gonna, God going to bless you, bro. God going to bless you. If he see you doing something positive and something that can benefit you or benefit your family or benefit the people... He gonna bless you in so many ways. It's not it may not come all at once, but he gonna bless you, bro. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Cause I started with nothing. When I say I, I jumped out here with nothing, I'm like I say I'm three days out of my rent. I boom, I took a loss of that. I I didn't got evicted because of that shit and everything. I didn't got a new apartment and everything. You know what I'm saying? Like it's it take chances. That's why I say too with the restaurant. Boom, I jumped out there with that. I put everything in. I could have put that on my rent, knowing that I was. You know what I'm saying? A little late, you know what I'm saying? Didn't have everything at once. I could have, boom, hey, put this on my way so I can take it. Like, nah, I'm finna throw this into the restaurant because I know this money finna come in. You mm -hmm. feel me? But I took the L. You know what I'm saying? Like, you gotta get out there. You gotta jump out there, bro. Yeah. No matter what, go get you some money. Stay focused, stay grinding, man. That's all I wanna tell y'all, bro. And I hope this, you know what I'm saying? This is shed a little light on y'all. Y'all really get to just chop it up with me for me, not from what you hear, but me. You know what I'm saying? You really get to just sit down with Mike P and really know how he grew up and why he grind the way he do. You know what I'm saying? Because I just want to let y'all know, bro, like, I done been through a lot, bro, but at the end of the day, I ain't never stop. Y'all know I ain't never stop, bro. At all. That's all I want to tell y'all, man. For real. Hey, man. I appreciate you for even, you know, expressing yourself. on That's what Easy TV is for, for you to... Yeah. Express yourself and yeah. the people get to know who you are, as well as your talents. You know what yes, I'm saying? Sir. So, yes, sir. Shout out to you for that. Um, by the way, people, he.
like you said, invest in yourself. Don't be afraid to take risks. We definitely gonna do a follow up interview because, like, about three months from now, a month or two from now, I want to see the perfect progression. You know, so you got some yes, good sir. stuff here, bro. Like, yes, sir. that stuff, bro. You could get fifty dollars for those shirts. You know what I'm yes, saying? Sir. It's good quality too. Um, one one last thing, man. Let the people know where they can find you on the socials. I know it's right there, but I would rather you said. Yes, I'm, I'm gonna put it in the description too. So yeah, man. You got my Facebook name is GMT Mike P. You feel me, GMT Mike P. That is. My official Facebook page. Okay. Mike P. Taddy is my official Instagram page. But as in closing, I want y'all to follow Heart of a Hustler Movement on Facebook. I put a picture of the screenshot you know of it on me. Oh, I thought it was my th Instagram. Heart of Hustler Movement. Then I got my HOH clothing on IG. Mm -hmm. And then for your custom work, GMT Customs. Gotcha. GMT, I do want to elaborate on that. GMT stands for getting money team it's my get money team you feel me I, I i surround myself with people that want to get some money you feel me i surround my people I, I surround myself with people that's really focus on making better for their life you know what i'm saying like really out here getting some money i don't want to be around like you around the same energy that you is like if you hang with bums you gonna be a bum. I, I really believe in that. Birds of a feather flock together. I really believe in that. That's why I try to keep people around me that I can learn from. You know what I'm saying? That I can get wisdom from. Or I can teach them or they can teach me. You know what I'm saying? So before we close this, I just wanna shout out to everybody that's doing stuff. Like I'm I'm naming some stuff that's just off the top of the head. So you feel me like don't get in your feelings if I don't shout you out because, you know what I'm saying, this is live. You feel me? I just ain't got nothing wrote down straight off the head. Mm -hmm. So, you know what I'm saying? I do want to give a big shout out to Only in Waco, you feel me? That's Wes Dwayne. That is my business partner when it comes to these clothes. Like, bro really helped me take off with my clothes again. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all got to think out here, you got Debo TV. You know what I'm saying? Debo, he do customs. He killing with the shoe customs right now. Like, if you need some custom shoes, holla at Debo, you mm -hmm. feel me? You got a little grandma out here with her, with her liquor. You know what I'm saying? Liquor licks. She popping right now with the liquor. You know what I'm saying? Iconic, he do shirts. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to GH Apparel. You know what I'm saying? He do music also. Check him out. You feel me? Shout out to my nigga Lil Dice. He do music. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You got teenage out here. He do music. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all really just got to support your people, man. Support your people yeah. in any way possible. There's a lot of locals out here really doing something. You know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to shout out some people off the top of the head and let y'all know, man. Y'all shop with y'all people. Shop with the inner cities. There's a lot of young people out here doing some stuff. We really trying to make Waco different. Everybody needs to really just link up and get some money. Everybody sit down. Everybody know everybody. So I don't see why y'all hating. This is the only city that I've ever lived in. Like I say, I'm from Killeen. This is the only city I've ever lived in where there's so much hate and everybody know everybody, bro. Like, we really can take off on Central Texas. Like, bro, Waco is where it's at. Them niggas out there getting some money. You know what I'm saying? They linked up on some real live business shit and they, they got a plaza. That's what I'm really trying to see one day, like five years from now, three years from now. Everybody from Waco that's really doing something, we just get us like a shopping center like, the motherfucking new mall or some shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Everybody put in their rent. Everybody do what they got to do. Yo shop right here. They shop right here. This, this, and that. Everybody coming in the same pot. We all eating. Bro, that's love, bro. That's all I want to see out here, man. Y'all y'all really, look, we really can get some money, bro. I ain't going to say that. I'm going to say that a lot, bro. We, it's really a lot of money out here, bro. Yeah. We really, if everybody link up. For sure. Well, definitely going to do a follow-up. Until next time. Yes, sir. Peace.